I cannot remember exactly how we met, but I will tell you this one thing. Never before have I encountered a more fearsome and heartfelt crew out on these seas. They were fearless and skillful with a blade. We battled skeletons, skeleton ships, and we sang wonderful shanties together. But then, while we were battling an ancient pirate captain for his bones, my men were killed in combat. As the only survivor, I carried the prize loot back to the ship all by myself, worried that this was what was left of my crew's legacy. However, as I was preparing to set sail, I spotted sails on the horizon. Fearing that it might be an enemy, I grabbed some cannibals and prepared myself to defend the legacy of my crew. However, that defense be not necessary, because it was them. I was fortunate enough to see that they had respawned and joined me in their own ship. Reunited, we sailed for the nearest outpost and cashed in all of our glorious loot. Songs sung and grog gone, our adventure came to a wonderful end. Pretty epic adventure if I do say so myself. What do you think, Tess? No? You think it's nonsense? <sighs> well, fuck you then. Gold Hoarders, I am looking for gold. Have you got quests for me? Yes, you have, good sir. I'm going to be buying all of them from you. Thank you very much. And there is my ship. I have yet to give this ship a name yet. I want to. I simply haven't done it. But we're not here to do that. We're here to propose a quest, go down and hunt some treasure, and then cash that treasure in for fat stacks of gold. Because that's what pirates do on Sunken Grove. Sunken Grove. It is just over to the west of us. Piece of cake. So welcome to the Sea of Thieves. This is a game that has, I don't know, about 2 million videos of it up on YouTube already. But I've always wanted to make videos of it my own, and I've finally gotten around to doing it because I procrastinate like a mother f But we are in the game now, and it is glorious. Look at how beautiful this game is. Everybody says it. Everybody who gets in this game says how gorgeous it is, and you can see why, because it is stunning. Sunken Grove is dead ahead, straining the ship up, and I am going to go to the Crow's Nest to switch the flag out to the Alliance flag, because I simply am not in the mood for wars tonight, and hopefully any ship we come across will be friendly. Avast, ye land lovers, we have arrived at the Sunken Grove. Hopefully none of you got seasick on that short journey. And there is treasure in the water just outside the- oh, hang on, I thought I put the frickin' anchor down, but I guess not. Anyway, there is, there is treasure over there, so I think I'm going to go ahead and retrieve that. Uh, and just for the record, I would like to point out that I am not a novice to this game. I have been playing it for quite some time, as I'm sure you can tell by the gorgeous colors. Ooh, hold on, what do we have here? This is the Order of Souls flag. I will be taking that. As I was saying, I am not new to this game, as I'm sure you can tell by the gorgeous colors adorning my ship. I'm gonna go ahead and put this flag on board the ship and go back over to the treasure in the water, which I assume is from a boat that sunk here before I got online. Aha! There's a chest as well. I'll definitely be taking that. Let's pop this bad boy open and see what's in it. Ooh, a skull! That's good. <laughs> Okay, let me make myself clear. Walking is boring, so I'm gonna use a cannon! Whee! Oh! Okay, well that didn't work as well as I'd hoped. I'm in the sea! That's not where I wanted to be. I can hear skeletons. Oh, I see you. I don't have time for you, buddy. Just another day. Seeking treasure left to gather dust at the campfire at the fishing camp on the west shore is high ye lanterns thrust. Okay, so I'm looking for the campfire. I think this is it right here. Let me just hold my lantern up. Yeah, there we go. Look at that. Ooh, a green flame. I bet bacon would taste good on that. So what now? Reading this map, a clue you'll see if at the grave on the lonely isle to the west he's standing be. Well, I know where that is because we walked past it on the way over here. It's right here. So, uh, and oh, look at that. There is the grave. That was not difficult at all. And uh, there we go. Unlocking the fourth and final clue. Tell me where the treasure is, come on. At the monstrous remains on the northwest beach, ye, ye reward is almost found. Eight paces west by southwest, and break the ground. Okay, gotta find some bones. 
Well, I found some remains that look pretty monstrous. Uh, what do we do? Eight eight paces west by southwest. Okay, let me get my compass out. And uh, west by southwest. And here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now, before I dig this, there is a snake. Okay. We can dig up the treasure now. And there it is. I'm just the best. Treasure is aboard the ship. Now, this was the only chest that I had to grab on that island, so I'm gonna pop it open. And that's not too good, but I'll take any gold. Yeah, that is a ship on the horizon, but I believe it is stationary and facing away from us, so I'm not too worried about them. Anyway, we have another map, or another riddle, rather, which says on Crooked Mass, which is not too far from here, I believe. I think it's, uh, actually, I think it's to the south. And yeah, there it is. Crooked Mast is where we go next. I've just spotted something on the shoreline. Well, that was satisfying. That island dead ahead be the crooked mass. Now, I am keeping a weather eye for other ships because I, as mentioned before, am not in the mood for war. Uh, I don't see anything on the horizon, which, oh, never mind. That, I swear to God, that was not there two seconds ago. It's an AI ship, which is fine. As long as we don't get too close to it, it will leave us alone. So I'm not worried about that. Well, welcome to the Crooked Mast. I have elected to dock my ship in between these rocks uh, for safety reasons, and it is beginning to rain as well. That's not good. But there's a chest up there. It's not the one we're here for, but it is there. Pulling out the riddle because I don't actually know what I'm supposed to be looking for here, and oh my. Look at this guy. I guess, uh, I guess he had a little too much to drink. Ha! Sit rep! I have spotted a skeleton chilling out on that rock. I'm gonna snipe him, and he didn't die. Actually, I think that's a skeleton captain. It is a skeleton captain. I'm gonna be having your head, sir. Uh, uh, take that. Do you like the sharp end of my blade? I hope so. Oh my god. What? I just died to lightning. The chest is close at the anchor at the Kraken Slayer's grave. Kraken, Kraken Slayer's grave? What's a Kraken Slayer? Looking for a Kraken Slayer. I, I don't know what that's supposed to look like, so I'm just gonna rummage around the island. Uh, that's not a grave, that's just a dead guy. Uh, grave, grave, grave. What would a... Oh, hang on. We have some, uh, uh, ghosty boys to deal with. Ouch, ouch! You really hurt! That ri- and they- oh, hang on. No, no, I'm not having this. I'm not dying twice in the span of a minute! Get out of here! Get out of here! <sighs> okay. Kraken's grave. What's a Kraken Slayer's grave look like? Okay, well, those ghost boys actually really did hurt, so I'm gonna eat some bananas before going back on the island, because I don't want to run the risk of being killed again. Just wanna find the treasure and get out of here. Okay, so I wasn't able to find what looked like a Kraken's Grave on the bottom bit of the island, so I've climbed one of the peaks to see if it's up here, and there's my ship down there. This door- oh, hold the phone! What? There's a ship right there! Uh, and it's called CD's Nuts. Really? Well, th that's it. That's my life over. Okay, well, I don't know what the deal with that ship is, because it sailed within point-blank range of our ship and, I guess, just didn't see it. Or, it saw our ship, and, and they decided to ignore it. Either way, I'm happy. Ain't got time for you, skellies. Good, well, just leave me alone, and there'll be no- oh, That one's got an explosive barrel. Quickly, shoot it! Oh! That could have been way worse than it actually was. Well, my patience is starting to waver. I have been on this island for a considerable amount of time now, and I have not found anything that looks like a Kraken's grave. It- there's a snake right there. Hang on. Okay, we can cross now. I feel like I've searched every nook and cranny on this island multiple times, and I still haven't f OUCH! F snakes! Is this a Kraken Slayer's grave? No, no, it looks more like the Church of Satan's registration desk. What does it say again? South uh, friggin' Kraken Slayer's Grave. That's the only information we get. Uh, it says to the to the southwest. You know, what? I'm just gonna try it. Maybe this is the Kraken Slayer's Grave. To the southwest. Uh, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Is it here? F 
I don't understand. What do you want from me, game? Where is this Kraken Slayer's grave that you speak of? It must be... Oh, you, oh, for frick's sake. You know what? That's it. I'm committing a genocide against all snakes right now. All snakes must die. I'm sick of them constantly spitting poison at me. Leave me alone. Am I just being dense? Because I've been on this island for two in-game days, and I have not found the Kraken Slayer's grave. So I'm going to go ahead and take some fruit and keep searching because it's the only way we can actually progress. There must be something that I'm missing. What's this over here? There's an... Oh! It was here next to my ship the whole frickin' time! So I am just dense. I am not a gambling man, but I am willing to bet a considerable sum of pennies that the chest that's located here uh, is is basically worthless. And it should be here. Dig! Okay, so the chest is here, and it's- oh god, skeletons! More skeletons! And I freaking missed the shot at point blank range. Good lord, I cannot get anything right on this freaking island. Die, skeletons! What is in this chest? Uh, actually, that's not bad. That's not bad. I will gladly take it. I will gladly take it. Next quest, Shipwreck Bay is where we need to go next. Making my way upstream, sailing fast, digging gold with my shovel. dee 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 doo doo dee doo dee 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 Ooh, there's a ship over there. Hopefully they leave us alone. You can't be on the ship all the time, so you have to use different tactics to make sure that it stays safe. I am changing the lanterns on my boat to red, because red is menacing, and hopefully people will see the red lights and be like, oh sh**, stay away from him. And look at that, I don't even need to dig up treasure to get the treasure. I come to an island and the treasure is just already sitting out in the open, because that's how amazing I am. This is a bounty skull, I will be taking it. Whoa! F there's a ship there! Excuse you! What is with these teleporting ships coming out and- He's not firing! He's- he always waving to me. Guess he's friendly. I'm gonna respond with ahoy! Sheesh, that gave me a heart attack. What is- who knew that ships could teleport in Sea of Thieves now? Am I just getting extremely lucky with these ship encounters, or has everybody in Sea of Thieves decided to be friendly all of a sudden? That is weird. I'll be honest, I'm not too sure I'm supposed to be- Okay, there's a skeleton. There's a skeleton captain. Die, foul demon! Die, you're interfering with my quest for treasure. In fact, killing you is only gonna make me more rich because you're gonna drop your skull. Come on, die. No, you're not allowed to heal. You're not allowed to heal. There you go. Finally, he's in Davy Jones' locker. Ooh, yes, that's a good skull. I will gladly take that. Riddle says to look for a wrecked robo, and I think this is it. Let me just play a shanty real quick. Uh, Bosun Bill. Yeah, there we go. Fantastic. Okay, what now? Says, lantern held high, a clue unravels. When to the birdcage and the Captain Pandragon's quarters, ye have traveled. Birdcage? Ca Captain's quarters? Where would I find that? Uh, ooh. Excuse me, good sir. Are you Captain... Uh, are, are you are you Captain Pendragon? Well, if so, then, then, geez, what happened to your ship? Let's see, if it is you, then there must be a birdcage in here somewhere. Uh, oh, there's a birdcage in the corner. Okay, let me just, uh, uh, what did I have to do again? Hold up my lantern. Okay, all right. And... Yeah, okay, so you are Captain Pendragon. Thank you very much. I'm just here for your treasure. Don't worry about it. What thou must I do now? Find the scarecrow beside the inner shallow pool. Uh, this inner dance will be a worth six paces south and break the earth. A scarecrow and a shallow pool. Now, before we do go looking for that scarecrow, I did see something glinting in the bowels of this ship on my way over. And yeah, there is something in there. I think it could be bonus treasure. And it is. It's a seafarer's chest. Thank you very much. I'm going to take this back to my ship as bonus loot. Thank you, Captain Pendragon. I will not mention your name. What does a scarecrow in Sea of Thieves look like? Is this supposed to be a scarecrow? It's just a stick with a skull on top of it. Uh, well, let's try. Let's see. No, I'm not holding the compass out. Holding it inward. We need to go south by six paces. Three, four, five, six. 
Well, this is in the bush. You can't dig in the bush. Let me, can I just step outside the bush? And eh, no. And eh, yeah, there is a chest. So far, the loot in these particular chests has not been too valuable, so let's find out what is in you. And that's not great either. But I will take it. Any amount of cash helps. That skeleton captain that I killed when I first got here, he also had a riddle on him. Uh, and it says, beneath the monstrous remains on the north side of the island. So we have to go over there. Well, call me Indiana Jones because I just found them. Here is your shanty. Yes. Revealing the next clue. That is brilliant. What must we do now? Birdcage, Captain Pendragon's quarters. Oh, I know where that is. We were just there. Captain Pendragon, with your beautiful glowing eyes, I have come to disturb you once again. Not intentionally, uh, but you know, I'll do anything for more loot, because I'm a loot whore, so we have to raise our lantern to this birdcage. Uh, oh, sorry, raise the map to the birdcage, like, uh, similar to what we did earlier. So, there you go. Thank you very much for the tip, Captain Pendragon. Uh, walk to the Scarecrow beside the Inner Shallow Pool. We did this already! This is the same freaking quest, except for compass directions. Although I suppose giving me the same quest is actually good for the sake of convenience. Is it here? Yes it is! That is fantastic. I am the best at finding treasure. If it's a captain's treasure chest, I will find it too. Yet another chest is on board, and that is brilliant. We are stacking up the loot, uh, which means that things- Oh, that is some good freaking loot. That's a good chest. I'm putting that up in the crow's nest. We have approximately two more chests to find before the end of the quest, and both of those chests are on Crook's Hollow. So that is our next and final destination. Let's get out of here. Some new developments. I have just spotted... Yeah, that's a galleon. And it's a player galleon as well. Hmm. Hopefully, they just politely ignore me. I'm hoping, because typically when a galleon- oh, there's another ship off our starboard, but typically when a galleon sees a sloop, they just go, ooh, candy, and start hunting them down, so, uh, hoping for the best here, because we do have a lot of loot on board. Also gonna be keeping an eye on that sloop off our starboard side, because I don't want him to get any funny ideas. Uh, oh, what's that music for? Uh, oh my. Oh my god, that's a megalodon. Okay, well, there's one thing I really didn't need in my life right now. It's a freaking giant shark coming to ruin my day. Excuse you, good sir, but I don't have time for this nonsense. Oh gee, okay, well, I guess, I guess, um, I guess we're gonna have a fight with a shark. Uh, actually, no, that, th I'm gonna make for that island dead ahead, which actually I think is Crook's Hollow. But it is the closest island to us, and that's the only way I can get the shark to sod off. Okay, I've made an executive decision. I'm going full steam ahead for whatever the equivalent of a sailing boat is towards Crook Hollow. The Megalodon is still over there. I can see its fin poking out of the water. I'm going to try to get there as quickly as I can. I'm also going to load the cannons uh, just to be safe. That, I, that way I can fire upon the Megalodon if it decides to come over here and test me. Uh, okay, alright. It's still behind us. And, oh, it just despawned. Hooray, we win! Uh, oh, hold on a second. What? Oh, fuck me. That's the galleon. Not only did it see us, it's following me. It's coming for, oh, no, 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 not now. I don't want to call the shot before it's been pitched, so to speak, but I don't see the galleon anymore. I think it's behind that rock, which means we might be able to lose it. Might be. I don't know how you're supposed to lose a galleon in a sloop, but uh, the simple fact is I don't see it anymore. So I think, I think we can relax. There's Crook's Hollow. We're almost there. I think, oh, the shark is back. What is the matter with you? I mean no harm. Leave me alone. Crook's Hollow is right there. We can make it. I'm not going to fire on the shark. I'm not going to risk sinking the ship. If we just get near Crook's Hollow, the shark will bugger off. So all we have to do, I'm going to sail right towards the island. If we hit the island, so be it. As long as the Megalodon leaves us alone. Leave me alone, dang it. Okay, we are arriving at Crook's Hollow. I think the Megalodon is going to start off hoisting the sails, that way we don't crash into the island, because if I can avoid crashing, I will gladly do so. 
And, okay, the Megalodon is no longer ch chasing me, and there's the Galleon sailing away from us. That is fantastic. I think we're going to be able to get these chests. Lowering the anchor. So welcome to Crook's Hollow, everybody. We have approximately two chests to get on this island, and then we can go to an outpost to hand it in. The Megalodon, I think, is just going to hang out there. Hopefully it despawns. Go away, dang you! Two of the chests are on the same side of the island as me. Hold on a second. That's the Galleon. And it's coming over here. Well, f*** the chests. We have some bigger fish to fry. I don't have time for you skeletons. That galleon is coming for me. It's coming for blood. This is this is bad news, bears. This is really, really bad. We have cocking good loot on board. And there's a galleon bearing down on us. Yeah, they're coming over here. They are definitely coming over here. I've come up with a new plan. It's called Operation Getting the f*** out of here. You see, I've looked on the map. There is an outpost near-ish. I'm- Oh my god, the galleon is right there. We need to go now. We need to go now. Maybe the Megalodon will distract them? No, they, they don't give two shits about the Megalodon. They're here for me. We gotta go. We have to go now. This is getting dire. Oh, they're, they're taking shots at me. Okay, you know what? Ready on the cannons, and they're just out of range. They are just out of range. This is... Actually, we're on intercept course with them right now. I gotta adjust course, otherwise we're gonna hit them. And they're firing. It looks like they're getting ready to fire. I can see commotion going on on the deck. Cannons are still out of range. They're taking shots. Oh my, gonna pull my gun out. They're shooting the harpoon at me. Get back! Okay, they're turning away. That's good, that's good. That's gonna buy us some time. Like I said, there is an outpost near here. I'm making a break for it. They're firing cannons at me. They are firing cannons at me. This is not good. Here's the thing about quests in Sea of Thieves. Unless you dig up the chest, the chest will actually stay put. So my plan is to go to the nearest outpost, and that galleon isn't even turning to follow me, which is great. That's going to buy us some time. My plan is to make sail for the nearest outpost, cash in the loot before they inevitably kill me in the process. And the nearest outpost is Ancient Spire Outpost, which is actually quite close, but it's to the east, and we aren't even heading in the right direction. So I need to adjust course, uh, and, and hopefully we can turn in loot before that galleon catches up. And this situation is actually quite tense. For whatever reason, that galleon stopped, uh, although they did not stop anymore. They are now back on the chase. So we've actually got a little bit of time. The only downside is I cannot outrun them. The galleon is significantly faster than the sloop, so we're going to have to live on a prayer if we're going to get to this outpost. If this is going to work, I need to get every single hook I can get, including making sure that the sails are perfectly in the wind so we're getting the max speed. And... It sounds like, to make a bad situation worse, yup, the Megalodon has come back. Are you for serial right now? Are you serious, game? This is the absolute last thing that I need. I'm being hunted down by a galleon, and you decide to send the Megalodon after me as well. That's just an insult to injury, and I need to turn the ship, otherwise we're gonna hit that frickin' rock, and that would be really, really bad. Okay, we're gonna miss the rock, which is good. I have no idea where the galleon is or how close it is. I don't dare turn around because it could just be right behind me. Oh my god, this is terrible. Yes, there is the outpost. I can see salvation turning towards salvation. Where is the galleon? Where is the galleon? I'm almost there. Come on, please. Please, Lord, don't let this happen. Oh my god, they're right behind me. Holy sh**. That's terrifying. Okay, you know what? I'm not going down without a fight. If it's gonna happen, it's gonna happen. Eat lead! Urgh. Oh my god, they've hit me! There's fire! Holy sh**! What do I do? Open fire back! Boom! Eat my cannonballs! Oh my god, I don't even know what's going on. I'm being shot! There's people on my ship! Holy c- And I'm dead! You're done. You're done. You know, I think working for the Merchant Alliance would be much more safe. Yeah, safe. <laughs>